Everybody, this is JT here once again, doing my third episode of this healing guide. I know I haven't been really regular with these guides at all, but you know, I've been trying my best. I've had a lot to deal with getting ready for college. It was more than I expected, the freaking like five, six trips to college in one week. And that's, the, I'm not even going there yet. I'm just getting all my paperwork and everything again. It was a pain in the butt. But anyway, I have been playing a lot of WoW. I am a level like 84 now. Um, we're really close to level 84, so I kind of just lied to you all. Um, actually, when I hit 80, I learned a lot of stuff that I just didn't really care to learn about healing when I was lower level. It's like, I didn't care to, like, really research any shit or pay attention to what these spells did because it was like, cast them and they heal the prick. And they were the tank. Sorry, I don't mean to call tanks pricks, but a lot of the time they can be. Anyway, um, so I'm just, I'm level 80 now. I'm doing a heroic. It's, what, not that hard here. It's, they're fairly easy. Um, I thought you could go to heroic till you're level 82, Q into them. It turns out you can only Q till you're level 81. Which sucked for me because I wanted to get some more justice points to get some heirloom gear for my rogue that I'm going to be leveling and doing PvP P with for another series. Which he's level 4 and he's got uh, shoulders and chest. I want to get at least a dagger before I start Peavers peeing. So that's my goal. Anyway, that's what I'm doing with my druid who is level 84. I'm doing the, so, you know, whatever. So basically, this is just the same as any other healing here. It's fairly simple. I'm also trying to work on some Peavers pee healing. Um, I don't know how that's going right now. It's been up and down a little bit just trying to get some gear. I'm sitting at an item level of 309, which I, I don't think is bad at all. I think that's fairly good. Um, I haven't done really any quests with my druid. I've just been doing uh, dungeons, running, and healing. So, yeah. Uh, this, I don't know. Right now, I'm at a point where it's like... It, it, some of them are still face roll, and other times it's like you get a crappy tank, you get a crappy group, and you're like, the healer's got to work his butt off. But pretty much, it's it's easy. You get enough procs, you get enough everything, buffs, you know, it gets everything. I'm going to go through my talent trees in my next video, or the video after that, and I'm going to go through strictly what's procking, what buffs are coming up, and all this stuff, and, you know, just what I mean by all this later on. Um, this video is a little bit long. I didn't really fast forward any of it like I should have, but I just kind of haven't put up a video in a while, so I figured, you know, let's just let this roll the way it's going to happen. So... Um, unfortunately for me, college is starting, well not really unfortunately, college is starting in a week, a week and a half, which is, is a good thing, I'm, I'm ready for the step now, I wasn't ready last year, I did like a victory lap just because I wasn't ready, probably said this about a million times, but I, I wasn't ready for college, uh, I'll fall out a minute, I didn't know what the fuck I wanted to do, now I do, I'm ready, um, Reffing's gonna really start to pick up this year. We lost a lot of, a lot of guys during doing that, so I got a lot of roughing I'm gonna do. So I don't know how my videos are gonna be, so I'm trying to stockpile a bunch of videos right now and all that. So hopefully we'll still be able to get a couple good videos out a month, a week, whatever. I'll try my best. That's all I'm gonna promise right now. There's a ton of games coming out though. Freaking Skyrim, Dead Islands, uh, freaking Battlefield, you know, all those games. It's gonna be sick. So yeah. Just, I'm running this just, you know, just for the heck of it. Every once in a while I hit the wrong button and, you know, things pro things go up that I don't want to go up. But, you know, I make normal mistakes. Usually I'm able to solve them. I was going through this one group where I had this dick guy. He's like, oh, my guy's the top druid healer in the, this, this realm, blah, blah, blah. He gave me the name and the guy was, like, logged on already. And I'm like, dude, the guy's logged on and you're on this character. It's not you. He's like, blah, blah, blah. You should be using this spell here. I'm like, dude, I have, like, full mana still. We so I have all my cooldowns up and you're alive. What else do you want? I don't know. Some people are pricks. As, as a healer, you gotta you take a lot of shit. Same as a tank. I've tanked before. I know they take shit. And healers and tanks will blame it on each other. Why would you? Just unite and blame it on the DPS. It's, it's probably their fault for pulling aggro anyway. We all know it is, right? Yeah. So. So, um... I'll go over my talent trees probably in a later video. Um, there is a video already up where I went over my talent trees before, but I have... Um, done a little bit, or they're basically the same, but I've added more points into them, so I should go over them again. I might just go wait till 85 and go over them, because one level away, I, I don't know. It depends what I feel like. I'm going to go over my gear and, you know, why I pick this over this and that. Um, I'm going a lot of intellect right now, and um, some mastery, because I don't mind the mastery for this. I'm not really sure I'm experimenting, though, so, you know, I'll come out with something in the future what? more efficient and stuff but yeah so anyway you know 
This is actually a pretty sick dungeon, or um, little instance for the heroics, five man. Um, I like how easy it is now that it, most people got Kata gear in like your groups because you just get all the achievements like right off the bat. It's just like done, achievement, boom, next. Oh, a new achievement. Yeah, it's it's really simple. I love Kata dungeons are awesome too. Like I said, I'll be 84. Looking forward to some new stuff when I hit that 85 mark. You know, just hit up there and keep going. Pound through this stuff for you guys. Make some videos. I've also recently been playing a ton of other games. Um, got some videos from some other games that will be coming up. I can't really remember what they are off the top of my head because I forget what games I filmed and I want to get people's hopes up and then be like, where'd that video go? Sorry, I don't have it. Whatever. So she's happy to slaughter them in our name. This is fairly easy. Like healing here, I I think I'm overhealing actually. Probably could just do like a rejuvenation and be like, yeah, I did it in a wild growth. <laughs> I healed that hole with two spells. Could be that easy, you know. It's it's not that hard. It gets a little more complicated in the future. It depends who your tank is. You just gotta you gotta test the waters. You don't be worried to overheal. Get your right off the bat. Because you don't know if that tank's going to take the damage, but slowly let your heals peel back and see what heals are necessary to keep up. You might find that you could you could heal something with a rejuvenation instead of putting up all these other hots and then being like, oh, I didn't need those, right? It, it, it could be as simple as that. You, you don't know. You just let your heals peel back and see what you need. Add the heals when you need it. You don't have to overheal all the time. But we get the Incredible Hawk achievement here. It's fairly easy. It was actually really easy. Freaking, oh my god, so much, like, I like how it's like, school starts, and when school starts, an event starts in World of Warcraft, so it's like, hey guys, you guys are going back to school, but fuck school, let's play World of Warcraft. It's really funny that way. Also, it's like, you guys are going back to school, let's release Dead Islands on the day that you guys are going back to school. What's with that? I, I don't know. But um, I'm definitely getting that game the day it comes out. I got orientation that day, and I guess who's not going to orientation, because orientation apparently is... Bullshit, it's like nothing, so I'm just not gonna go to it. I figure why go to it if it's not gonna do anything for me, I might as well go get a game and you know, waste my life with the game. Anyway, um also it's like a whole bunch of good movies are coming out and I just don't know. I don't know what Oh, I've been playing some League of Legends a bit again, and a couple of League of Legends videos should be out in the future. I kinda stuck at it now because I haven't played it for a little bit. But they should be out. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Got a Razor Naga now, it's freaking sick mouse, recommend it to anybody. Any type of gamer, you don't gotta be a World of Warcraft gamer to use a Naga, it's 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 just a nice mouse, it really is. Um, people have asked me what this uh, add-on that I use, this the middle UI add-on here, it's called Healbot. It's very simple to set up, um, just take your time set it up and you're good to go, it's not that hard. I'll go through my setup <laughs> and one of my next videos or something, probably when I do my uh, tree, talent trees, and you know. I'll just go over some of my stuff that I use. It's it's really easy. It's simple healing add-on. Yeah. So um yeah, you guys are some piping carrying motherfuckers. Ooh. We're pretty much getting carried through here. It's not that hard. Like right here, I could probably put rejuvenation in. That could have been it on this guy because you know he was taking like zero damage. So you just gotta remember that stuff. Like I I literally don't have to put anything. I found out. To restack life bloom, just cast like rejuvenation, regeneration, regeneration or whatever. Not rejuvenation. The one that's like not the. It's a hot, but it's you know, it still has a cast time. Cast that or cast healing touch or nourish, and your uh, life bloom will reset, which is nice. If you're, uh, I think you got to be specced into it or glyphed into it. I'll I'll look it up. I know all I know is I'm specced or glyphed into it, and it's really nice. And I did that on purpose, not by accident. Um, all I gotta know is, it's like, put it this way, you guys can look at my talent tree and be like, awesome, your your healings are great, you're procking these high numbers, but to beat me, try messing around the talent tree be like, I don't know why he has this here, do this, and post a video response of it when I make that video, I'll probably say that in the video too. These videos are not like, this is how you have to do it, no, it's this is my opinion on it, give me yours. This is how I heal, is there a better way to do it? Can I get more healing out of my mana? Can I can I hit higher numbers? Should I be put in haste or should I stay in intellect? Should I do this? Should I do that? It, it's it's all manner of you. Tell me what your opinion is, and I'll tell you mine, and we'll, and we'll see where we get. Maybe maybe mine will be better than yours. You might tell me yours, and I might be like, hey, 
but this is why I did it this way, and you'll be like, oh, that makes more sense. Or I might look at yours and be like, I feel like an idiot now, basically. Who knows? It's, you know, that's what this video is about. And it's, I don't know, just communication between healers. It's trying to create a better environment for us. You know, healers unite instead of fucking being picked on. Bullies in the game, freaking DPS and tanks, picking on the healer. Everybody dies, and it's the healer's fault that he could not stop a million damage to each guy because they didn't know how to run out of the fucking blast or whatever and some bosses. Oh my god. I had the one boss in, uh... I don't know, it was one dungeon and he like pulls you in and then you, everybody has to run away from him or they'll just get mass damage and most of them will die. And no one decides to run away. And they're all like, oh, so I said we're done, Or the one time I'm like, BRB, because I literally had to go to the bathroom and answer the door. Actually, I answered the door, then I went to the bathroom. I didn't just like leave the guy at the door as I was going to the bathroom. No. But, um, and they're like, I came back and they're like, where are they here? Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, did you guys know how to read messages? I put it in caps for you guys, too. Or, I call it, or the one guy, I'm like, I was just gone. He's like, next time, be like, BRB, or, I gotta, or I'll be right back, or something. I'm like, did you read the message? It's right there. He's like, you put it there. I'm like, I went back in time and put it there. Thank you. Therefore, I put it there before I left. And he's like, oh, that makes no sense. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Fucking idiots. Wow, nerds. What can you say? So, I hope you're liking the quality of these videos. Um, I am working my best to make the best qualities. It's, I think they're like pretty sick, but that's just me, you know. I love the way my tits look in the sun, but I don't look at my tits in the sun. Maybe I do. Don't judge me. Anyway, I like, I don't know. The, these videos are going to be focused on here. Yeah, I talk nonsense a lot. I've been watching a bunch of TV shows. I watch random ass TV shows. I watch like fucking Naruto. I'm not ashamed to say it. I watch like Naruto. I watch Death Note. Like I watch this all Death Notes over and over again. I love that. Um, leave your favorite like anime in the comments. I'm looking for a new one to start watching too. Um, I watch and then I watch like the show like Hawaii Five O. I watch Rookie Blue, CSI, NCSI. Uh, fucking I watch everything. I Your Highness was the funniest movie I've seen in a while. I've seen that movie like six times already. Oh, if you guys didn't know it, um, it's rumored that Chuck Norris is going to be in the next Expendables movie. So he's going to be in Expendables 2. Rumored. It's not confirmed or anything, so don't get your hopes up. But that'd be sick if he was in there. But I have a theory that if he's going to be in there, he's going to play a very small role like, uh, the Terminator did. He's just going to be like, you know, make a joke out of it and then he's gone or something, right? Who knows? I, I would love to see if he's in it, where they're going to place him. Um... Also, what what else is in recent news? Oh, the, uh, they're making another Underworld movie. It's pretty much uh, the trailers have been out. I'll leave a link to in the description to the trailer. I personally love those movies. See, tell me what you guys think about them. I love the last one, couple. I'm also thinking about starting something like you know. Okay, I've been watching like I watch CFTFX, whatever you know, Charles Trippy and Ali Speed and all them. I watch like show YouTube stuff like that and I find them very interesting too sometimes and they started like a movie club and I know I have like no fan base almost but I'm thinking about almost starting a movie club where I don't have a camera or anything to film myself or I would but I'm thinking about playing I don't know some game I'll put like the trailer and then I'll play s or something you know I'll name the movie, you guys can watch it, I'll play the trailer or something, and I'll write a blog about it, discussing it, and I'll also do a video, I'll play like World of Warcraft or something, or Peeverish Free Match, and in it, I will literally discuss like, the movie, I don't know, Elf, the Christmas movie or something like that, and the like, you know, give me a yes or no in the description, I'm honestly thinking about it, I might make a couple episodes, put them out there and see what happens. Um, if I do, in the description under this, I'll probably be leaving the video. Um, you guys can make video responses to it too, and video response to this video, and I will put them in that video. At the end, like they did. I'm kind of stealing their idea, their idea, but it's an awesome idea, and I think, you know, it gets people discussing it. You can watch theirs and watch mine. It doesn't really matter. It's, I'm not being like, oh, mine's better than theirs or whatever. You know, I'm not even trying to compete with them. I don't I don't care. I'm stealing their idea. I'll full out a minute. But I love movies. And that is a sick idea. It's going to, I don't know, probably create a better fan base for me or a bigger community type atmosphere. Um, also on our website, you guys can enter forms now. I'll leave the description below. I haven't really been working on it much, but it's up there. Um, 
yeah. I recently watched some leaked footage from Skyrim and some shit, and it was awesome. Um, uh, it's been taken down now, so I can't leave a link or anything. Plus, I don't, I don't like people leaking it, but unless the company does it on purpose, because then I feel like, oh, you know what? The company didn't want us to see this yet. They just wanted to create that hype. But in a way, it created so much hype because I watched it. And I'm like, oh my god, this is sick. Even though the quality sucked because it was off the cell phone. I like how here I'm an idiot and I'm standing in the stuff that's damaging everybody and I'm just like, I'm just gonna heal in here. Yay, I'm a moron. But yeah. So, we're three quarters, three thirds done, or three thirds, I guess we'd be fully done. We're like two thirds done this dungeon here. It's fairly easy. Nothing big. Like I said, easy face rolls, nothing a lot to talk about. But, um, yeah, so I figure we could, I could do like a movie club type thing, but use it through video games. I don't know. I, don't know, I, I might be able to find something cool, um, but I love videos and I like discussing some of that stuff through my videos and stuff. So I figured, you know, who knows? Let's, let's see where it goes. I have a spark shirt here pop in my room that's been here for like over a month. I should, I want to drink it, but it's halfway across my room. Can someone please come get it for me? I live in Canada, Ontario. Please come, come get it, someone. I would love it. Anyway, back, back to talking about this is like I don't know. I'd be talking more about the gameplay here, but uh, really, there's nothing to talk about here. You, you heal. You, you put your life bloom up, your rejuvenation, your wild growth, and you heal them. Later on, I'll go over some of my stacks and like I use the three light you stack your life blooms automatically on your tank. I put a rejuvenation up, and I've used before. I used to like I used to think like it was better to before the rejuvenation ran out, put another one up before it ran out, the timer went down, but no, because when it runs out, it does bigger heal, it's like final blooming heal is bigger, so you might as well let it run out and then put it on, because you're not saving yourself any mana, you're using the same mana, right? It's the way I think. So, um, yeah. Also, my League of Legends, I've been working on it, I love what they've done with that game. Oh my god, I'll obviously talk about that more in the League of Legends video than this one, but they've, they've overhauled that game a bit, and that new um, mode that they're bringing out with looks sick. I cannot wait for it. Like, it just looks awesome. Also, I've been watching some stuff from GamesCon, and oh my god, people over in Germany when it comes to some games are just insane. I want to go there next year. I want to make a trip there. I want to make a trip to all these freaking places. Like, I want to go to E3. I want to go to... I don't really want to go to Comic-Con. I hear it's not as cool. I hear it's pretty cool, but not that cool. I want to go to like E3, I want to go to BlizzCon, I want to go to all these places, I just don't got the money or the time right now to go do it. Um, I'm also trying to get in with a little bit with TGN, I've applied, um, hopefully they'll look at my videos and you know, I can get in with them, I, I hope, that's, that's a hope. I, I also would not mind being able to start to produce myself, be like, this is, I started by myself and I made it all the way to the top by myself, I'm not using TGN or Machinima. I would love to do it that way, but I know that's far, f you know, YouTube's gone past that. It's all about these community sites and coming together. So, yeah. See, the game guides in itself is kind of that, because I'm up to posting other people's videos on my channel. If they ever message me, be like, hey man, can you post my video? Maybe you can help me get some views, or I'll help you get some views. I don't know. I so, basically, got a couple more achievements. <laughs> throughout this whole run, it, it, you know, when I was doing these, it's like, achievement, 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 achievement. Those weren't my achievements, but I'm just saying. I've hardly done any quests with this guy. I don't even think I've hit, like, the 500 quest marker at 84. But I kind of was really lucky there that I just hit that little inlet or whatever there and was able to come back up. So right now in the background, if you hear any noise, it's from the movie The Fugitive, which is an awesome movie. I will probably put that on one of our movie club watch list or something you know write up something about it and we can all watch it so anyway here we go yep up up oh yeah here ew, ew. yep easy heals like as you can see all I'm doing is stacking life bloom and rejuvenation and that's basically all I do for the heals heal here um I hardly ever use my tree of life or my tranquility, but they are both my lifesavers. Like if I'm in dire need, I'll pop them and use them. They are my lifesavers. They are like, oh my god, I'm gonna fucking die. Use them. Um, I'll show you my glyphs. There's nothing real special with them. They seem pretty standard to me when I picked them out. Never really looked anything up about them, but I'm like, eh, this seems easy. So yeah. Um, not 
not much to say. Razor Nagas, they are kind of expensive, but they're worth it in my opinion. Pick one up if you can. Fucking college. So much shit to do in like... Hey, my friend, I bought like a $20 calculator. I'm like, oh, fairly nice calculator. You should do me. And my friend's like, you know what? We did, I did the same last year, but then they're like, you gotta go buy this $40 one from the bookstore. I'm like, I'm literally like, I owe my parents over 250 bucks for a refing clinic and some games I bought using their credit card. I mean, yeah, because I, yeah. But my refing clinic was 200 bucks this year, which I should be able to pay back, because I start refing on the 19th right now. But I gotta fix my skates. I literally have three pairs of skates. One I don't like to wear, because I gotta wear them in. Which is kind of ironic, because to make them so I like to wear, I gotta wear them. The other pair, the rivets, rivets on the bottom broke, so I have to get those fixed. And the other pair, I broke a blade, so I gotta get it fixed. And one, and the other one that I broke a blade on is held together by duct tape, which is basically duct tape but red, and it does for like insulation and shit. And we just had some leftover from uh, doing my grandpa's and my dad, so I just fucking like literally wrapped it and kind of melted it on there with a dryer and a heat gun. So it's it's good. I like them though. They're like my favorite pair of skates. And I got to get them repaired. It's gonna look. I'm gonna look like an idiot going to get them repaired. So anyway, we're pretty much at the end here. So I like to remember everybody to subscribe if they like my random rambling. Also, answer any comments that I have asked in the or questions I've asked in the. Fuck, I'm stupid. Any questions I've asked throughout this video, feel free to answer them in the comments. There we go. I got that right. Um, also, feel free to email me at the emails if you want to. You know, email me anytime. I'm not going to leave my email, but um, if you find it, email me. That made no sense. I just rambled on there again. Leave your video responses if you want to about your healing. Tell me I suck, because, you know, you all want to tell me I'm a noob. Leave your, you know, thumbs down, because people seem to like to do that for no reason. I know I do. I get off on it sometimes. Anyway, I <laughs> know I know. That would be fucking weird. There's probably some guy out there who does. He's like, oh, I gave him a thumbs down. Now I'm gonna jack off. Anyway, um, give me your thumbs up because I know you guys all love me. It's it's that easy. And remember to sub if you haven't already, and check out the rest of our videos. If you didn't like this one, we have a ton of videos on this channel. We have like 72. That is a lot to me. Anyway, peace out. Got my two achievements there, and um, you know, rocking everything. And look forward to our next Kata videos, or there'll probably be another heroic out before Kata. I don't know. Anyway, peace out. This is JT Killer, or JT, whatever I want to go by these days, rubbing my nipples and signing off. Bitches.